Hey everybody, my name is JPW03 and welcome back to another game recap. The Lightning loses one 5 to 4 in overtime against the Penguins. I think the word that could describe how I, we are as a team right now would be leaky. Uh, we seem to just not be able to close down the game like we're so accustomed to. And I think we're very spoiled in the sense of how good the Lightning have been at just absolutely closing down games. Obviously a bummer when you lose guys like Chernak and then you're playing five defensemen. But still stinks to lose the game the way we did. Why don't we go ahead and take a look at what happened? So things are going to start out fantastic for the Lightning. They came out ready to play Colton's going to be the beneficiary of a goal right here. It ends up hitting off Latang's face, who got really bloodied up. It was actually kind of scary to see. Uh, and then it just inadvertently goes off of Colton and into the net. I mean, Colton's not even looking at the puck. He'll take it, obviously. So 1-0 Lightning. And that is the first point for Jano as well. So good to see that. However, now in the second period, things are going to just fall apart. And I mean, that's kind of been the theme. It's just like there's just moments in game where like it seems to fall apart for the lighting. And that's Petrie's first goal. Don't blink because the second one's coming right after that one. Bad angle. Vassy kind of loses the net. And just like that, we went from being 1-0 up to 2-1 down. But still in the second period on the power play, the Bolts are going to score. It's going to be Braden Point right there on the rebound putting it past jari but then the lightning laps in concentration sergey goes to bat that one out of midair zucker gets on the end of it break away and he puts it five hole on vassy so we're down again in the second into the third period lightning do not score on a two-man advantage or full two minutes that kind of crossed over between the second and the third but right after that on the continuation stamkos buries that one absolutely beautiful shot we'll take multiple looks at it because it absolutely deserves multiple looks but man even jari gets a piece of the shoulder on it but it doesn't doesn't stop the puck because that's just what stammer does perfectly placed and man what a shot however i thought things were gonna fall apart here o'connor's gonna score and make it four to three gets by radish just recently called up uh from syracuse obviously it was a couple of the moves we're making and gets beat honestly there's just really no other way to put it o'connor beats him and he puts that one by vassy but then the big swede ties this game up at four and just look at that a little bit of a risky move by stamkos but hetty ends up picking it up puts it five hole on jari so we're tied up at four late in the third period so nobody scores the rest of regulation and we head into overtime stamkos kind of takes a tumble zucker one times that one and vassy's unable to get it and just like that the penguins win uh like you can see that the effort was there tonight i mean it wasn't a lack of that but man it's just like we're coming up across these teams that are just desperate for points and it's like it's not that we're not trying it's just we don't have that same level of desperation that these other teams are coming up against do this was better i mean i can't say that for some of the other games as of late obviously <laughs> last time we played pittsburgh for example but this one you can definitely see that it was closer it still wasn't matched but it was closer but Anyways, I don't have a whole lot else to say. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching this video. If you did, leave a like on it. If you're new, make sure to subscribe as it helps out a lot. Again, my name is JP. Thanks for watching. And as always, win or lose, go Bolts.